time for grows and it's forum chat time before we get started on this week's forum chat it really helps us if you can click us a like subscribe to our content this week's forum chat is about worn out keys so this isn't really going to happen to the glass key this is going to happen to your plastic key and as the key wears like as in the example i show here in a couple of pictures the unevenness of the surface causes the key to sort of get jammed in the docking station. I've seen videos online where people have pressed the key to stop the engine and the key doesn't extract and you have to give a couple of TVR style thumps to the dashboard just to get the key to release, which is all well and good and there's no real consequence to that. But I want to highlight a problem that is linked with a sticking key, which can have quite disastrous end consequences. Specifically, this is gonna be on the sport shift gearbox. So if we look at the video where I put that worn out key into the docking station, I'm starting the engine, I'm letting go, foot on brake, clutch learn. When it's done its clutch learn, that readily D goes solid. Now I try and extract the key and it won't extract because of the worn out keys, worn out buttons, and finally with a few jiggles around I can get the key to extract. So I just want to highlight the serious problem that could happen. This has happened to one of our customers where they've started the car from cold and you know they were in a cold climate so they just allowed the car to tick over and they weren't present in the car and this result happened. So we put the key in and now I'm holding the key in simulating the key being jammed and I'm holding the key in and this puts the clutch learn into a state of perpetual learn. You can see that red LED light just flashing and flashing and flashing. Then when I retract the key to its normal position, it takes the normal amount of time a clutch learn takes to learn. So in the case of my customer, where his key was sticking and it was sticking in that fully in position you know I had to simulate it there uh, he went indoors got his things together allowed the car to warm up and his car was just in a perpetual state of clutch learn so in that perpetual state of clutch learn it's pushing the friction plate against the flywheel kissing and then retracting kissing and then retracting to do a clutch learn normally that takes the set amount of time and that's the process finished but when it's in that perpetual learn it just keeps doing that forever until unfortunately in my customers experience it completely burnt out the clutch so especially on sport shift if you find yourself having to thump the dashboard or giving the key a jiggle around to try and extract it just make sure that when you do start up you're not in that jammed in position triggering a perpetual clutch learn hope you like that forum chat and we look forward to seeing you on the next one